It's time to get up. No. We have to get up. I don't want to. You have to get up. We have work to do. Actually, I'm going out, but I feel like we have to get up anyway. Do you want coffee? Is everybody ganging up on me right now? Good morning, Roscoe. Roscoe's going to drink your coffee. No, he just wants me to get up. Good morning. What are you looking for? If I have something crazy behind us. No, I just we have don't. board games. Board and games. My coffee, though. We're kind of boring family, except for we have a dog over here. And we have a cat over here. Everybody is circling for morning. They're, they all want their morning lovies. We're going to vlog our day. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos. We do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics. And then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is TwoCrazyKetos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. We should add to the intro, and sometimes I surprise Rachel that we're vlogging while she's still laying in bed. It's not good. It's just not good. You wake up looking so awesome. You really do. I mean, look, your hair looks awesome. Look, the cat wants to rub on us. You look great. What do you have going today? Um... I am actually going to get in my car because I've been up since 5 a.m. And I've edited our video that's getting released for Two Crazy Ketos. The cat won't stop budging me. I've done the kids ministry videos for not only this week, but for next week as well. Roscoe. And uh, I started working on a new Two Crazy Campers. But I am going to get in the car. I don't think you're going to want to come and head up to Gander in Fort Pierce because I need to return something. Mm -hmm. I need some lap sealant for the roof. We need some stuff for the chickens, like the the uh, hay kind of hey, whatever. What is that stuff? Hay. The shavings, the wood Bedding. shavings. We need that. And uh, I got a new hitch for our camper. I got What's a the hitch. It's called the Hensley hitch. And it completely eliminates sway. Well, it came with chops. I hope so, because I felt like we were driving a sailboat behind yeah, us. Yeah, last week home. the wind was so bad. Like, yeah, it was a little scary. Because I know we're weighed in right. But, so, yeah, it came with x chocks. So we bought x chocks last week, so I need to go return those. Okay. I also need to extend the cable for the trailer plug, because the Hensley hitch makes us an, a foot longer. So what are you doing today? Do you want to come with me? No, I think I'm just going to sit here, hold down this bed, pet this cat, <laughs> and drink my coffee. Well, when I get home, we have to film Keto on the Couch. Yeah. No, at some point, I've got to go and set up the rooms at church. Oh, I thought you did that already. I already did that part yesterday. So we have to film Keto on the Couch. We need to do a review for Oh Hello Bakery. Oh, hello. I'm excited about that. And I'll tell you what. I'm going to get in the shower, and I'm going to get going. You do whatever you need to do. But when I get home, not too late, the cat. What is with the cat? Very, what are very you doing? very aggressive. Being very aggressive. You know what it is? We're out of cat food. And so I fed him dog food. And <laughs> he's probably not happy about that. I got to go get cat food now. Um, when I get home, we're going to go to Texas Roadhouse and get prime rib. Because we still have... A $50 gift card that you got for your birthday. And I have deleted that gift card three times Ooh. out of my email. So we need to use it before I lose it. Use it before you lose it. Roscoe, what are you doing? Why are you being so lovey today? Go get my food. That's why I'm being lovey. And uh, we, we called Roscoe. Sent jealous over my here. jealousy. Look at this. Are you? Are you? petting another animal that's not me because i think you need to stop it's only a matter of time before she's in the bed 
Uh oh. This does not. We're about to get a smack. First, it starts off as love, and then it's a smack. Yeah. First, like Roscoe, will, like lick on him. Then she'll hug her, and then she's gonna smack her across the face. Right, Roscoe? Look at that face. Look at that. He's like, I am not happy right now. Displeased. This is the face of displeased. What are you doing, Tabitha? Here she comes. Oh, Oh, and she's up. Let's see. Oops. Sorry. I'm disturbing you. I'm going to take this one, though. What's wrong? This is a very momentous occasion. This is a huge day. Why is it a huge day? Because this is the day that normally... I would go backwards. So I would take a look at my (laughs) roots, which is a hot mess of crazy. In fact, I started to look at my roots and I'm like, is my scalp hot? Like, why is it so red there? But no, that is the ghost of hair dye's past. Because I have, like since I was 17, dyed my hair because that right there was my hair color at 17. And I did not want to face getting older, whatever that meant, getting older. So I had like a real Bella from Twilight, like aversion to growing old. So today is the perfect intersection of my purple shampoo just came in the mail to start dealing with some of the redness and bronziness going on in this nonsense. And my roots are at that place where I have to either go forward with gray, silver, whatever, or go back to the box dye. And I just, I want to, I want to do this. Okay. But we are going to have it professionally colored. We're just waiting for our appointment. We're waiting for our appointment, but it could be as much as a month, but this is not going to wait a month. Like in a month, I'm really going to look bad. So I would just like to do my part beginning to take out like all the fakeness so that I don't have to have a mess of bleach on my hair. So I just got here to Gander Mountain and evidently they're having a grand opening sale. Uh, Rachel's not gonna be happy that I came here without her because uh, me and sales usually don't do very well. Uh, but we'll see what they have. I gotta return a couple things. I'm looking for some like lap sealant. I just wanna make sure I have some like on hand in case there's any kind of problem or anything like that. So I went to Gander Mountain I did a review of a Jayco trailer for our camping channel, which you haven't seen that, I'll leave a link for that channel right up here. And then they had a bunch of deals on things, including some camp chairs and 50% off of the lowest ticketed price on shoes. So I got Rachel like five pairs of shoes. I can't wait to show them to her. Now I gotta head over to Tractor Supply to get the bedding and also some cat food. Are you serious? What? They needed a little bit of, like, a freshening up. They're chickens. So look at them. They're so happy. They don't need... Oh, my gosh. And the cool thing is they can totally eat all of these decorations. What is wrong with you? Lots of things. This is what happens when I leave and go to Gander Mountain. I have a feeling that you probably got into some trouble at Gander Mountain as well. Not like this. This isn't, this is just, this is silly. It's silly. Like you decorated the chicken coop. But they can eat all of the decorations. So I think that that's a huge win. Now you were doing this. I'm home. We're Uh, supposed to be going to eat. Yes. And I guess we're just going to eat without you taking a shower. I'm disgusting. We need to go, like, eat if you want to get prime rib because we're going to get there and they're going to be sold out of prime rib. I'm almost, I'm willing to be gross to get my prime rib. Okay, well, I need to quickly show you what I got because I did spend a bunch of money, but I got stuff for you. First things first. What is all this? Look at this chair. You got the chair you wanted. Yeah, but go ahead and have a seat. I'm so dirty. I got two of these chairs because they were on clearance for 50% off. Now lift up the one side nice. and it locks into place, but oh, you don't have it locked in. Oh, it have a little lunch pail? It's got a cooler. Oh my gosh. That is adorable. So they were normally 50 bucks and they were on clearance for 26. Wow. So we got two of those. 
But we're gonna store these inside of the trailers. They're not going underneath. No, you want to. I figure that. we're gonna put them like inside, like where the slide comes in, up against between the slide and the wall. There's enough room there. You want to see what else I got? Cause it's all for you. Of course I do. Okay, look at this. I got you. You wanted another hamper. This is my favorite thing, even at home. I love this thing. I know, but you keep forgetting to put them into the camper. Because I like them at home so much that I forget to put it in the camper. Yeah, they were having a grand opening sale. So even though we've been going to that gander for like, I don't know, five months now. Yeah. It's their official grand opening. So yeah, they were having some good sales. Is that like when you celebrate you've been married for six months and you're like, it's my wedding anniversary. So. I'm hoping this stuff fits you because all of these shoes, okay, so these shoes were $55. Okay. Marked down to 30. Still too high. Marked down to 14. And 50% off if you were a good Sam's member. Nah. $7.50. $7. We actually really need camel ones so for our next I, series. I know that you're like in between sizes. Like, so I'm going to turn this camera. I know like you're an eight and a half and nine. Yeah. So these are like heavy duty. So I bought you nine. I think that's better because you're going to wear a thicker sock. I these. feel like you could fit into, you. Can, it's easier to fit into a bigger size than it is to a smaller size. 750? So I, I got you can those. beat that. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Wait till you see these. I love $7 I, shoes. I know. <gasps> Purple. I like to slippers. Five I bucks. really do. Five bucks. Nuh uh. Yeah. So, what was the normal, the original price? Wow. $30. Now, I hope you got these a little larger than I would take because I don't like my heel going off they, the back. They came in small, medium, large, and extra large, and it said an extra large was a 9 to a 10. That's good. Normally, things like Crocs, we go down but because this, your heel is out, but I figured that again. I don't want to go out. That is for for five bucks? Five, five, technically, five fifty. dollars Wow. Yeah. Those are nice. Okay, you ready? Yeah. There was another pair of um, that I was getting for you, and then I, it was like, oh, look, eight and a half. They were perfect. They were like slip-ons, so it was real comfortable, almost like a water kind of sneaker. Uh -huh. And then as I was checking out, because they were like $80 down to 40 down to do 20 that. and then it was going to be $10, and it turned out they were men's sizes. Oh. And I was like, I was trying to do the conversion. What is the, who, let us know down below. What's like, the conversion? What is the conversion of a men's to a woman's or a woman's? So I was going to go back, and then I'm like, oh, I don't I'm care. Up here if I have it on my foot, it's a woman's shoe. I got these for me. Oh, wow. We're going to be matchy. So these were. How cute. $130. Dang. Marked down to 70 Mark down to 25 and then I got them for $12.50. $12.50. Okay, this is how we shoe shop. This is how we shop. I know. And believe me, I if, if it wasn't for the fact that it started adding up in my head how much I was spending, there were like 10 more shoes that I was going to get for you. But I didn't have you there. And like there were a lot of them it. that were like eight and a half. So I'm like, I think this is going to fit her. These are These perfect. These are waterproof. And I really wanted to get them for you, but I, without you there to try them Don't on, risk I didn't it. want to risk it because we're an hour and 30 minutes away from Gander. It's I need a to schlep to return it. But this is this is really awesome. And I know that there are a lot of people who will buy like Manola Blahniks. Right. Like, you know, like a $500 pair of shoes. But And I think that's awesome. And I think they're beautiful, but it's really hard for me to pay a big ticket for shoes. Yeah. And so I was funny. I was on my way out the door. But I want nice shoes. I was getting that lap sealant. I was getting the chairs. And then as I'm walking out, the <gasps> woman goes, Uh oh. Are you kidding? Uh oh. She didn't take off the thing. Uh oh. How are we going to get that off? The thing. I think bolt cutters. The thing. Don't wow. you hate that? One time, my mom. And the alarm didn't go off. My mom was wearing a security tag. Like what she bought it for like a wedding. She was going to a wedding and she had a fancy dress and they left the security tag on and she didn't notice it until she was getting dressed for the wedding. And she literally had to go over to the mall dressed for the wedding. Nice. So, well, I'll get it off. Last pair for you. Oh, these are Columbia's. Those are cute. And this, now they had two different colors, but one of them was only in an eight or nine and a half. And I'm like, ah. Uh. Those are so, so they, were, they had a light color as well that it was like more like this br light brown color. Yes. I wanted both, but these are a nine, so I'm hoping they fit you. 
These were $60, marked down to 40, marked down to 20. I got them for 10 bucks. $10. I love it. That, that is my love language. Deep discounts. Deep discounts. Get in the shower. You have five. This has to be like a, hey. a buy an RV thing. Lately, all I get is five minute showers. Well, do you want to get prime how rib? Long prime do, rib. How long do you need for a shower? Me? Less than a minute. Usually an hour to get ready. Now, I can, I can get ready in two minutes. Hey, if you want prime rib, we got to get going. Are you ready? Yes, let's go. Look at this weather. Okay, now, it's Florida. Scary. Scary. Is that really true? All I need is love? No, you also need prime rib. I need prime rib. That's love for sure. Prime rib. We're late. Hopefully they order. still have it. If they don't have prime rib, I'm we're leaving. Going, no, we're going to Pembroke Pines. They're going to sell out of prime rib before you get out of the car. Oh, I'm trying to pack everything. <laughs> My shoes fit though. Your shoes, they look good. Are they comfortable? They're super comfortable. Well done getting the bigger size because I would rather it be loose than be too tight, but they're not loose or tight. They're perfect. Good. So walk back to the car because you forgot your mask. We don't have masks. I can't believe that we're still doing that. We I be, don't know. We should be pros at this. Okay, grab me one. I need one too. Mine also has gross and makeup on it because yeah, I still do the bottom half of my face. I don't know why I put makeup on the bottom half of my face because no one ever sees the bottom half of your face. I'm kind of enjoying this mask because it's your mask and it smells like you. Oh. I smell like lipstick. You like berry blast. <laughs> Best day ever. Best day ever. They have prime rib. And, and lots of it. And the girl goes, guess what? You want 16 ounce? I can cut 20 ounces for you. We're like, yes, please. So we're gonna do, this. Is, we've never had one this big. A 20 ounce prime rib each. And then we're getting the loaded broccoli because we're celebrating Rachel's birthday. Even though her birthday was almost two months ago. That's okay. But we're gonna enjoy dinner, that's for sure. It's a very happy unbirthday to me. To me. It's getting good. Look at the size of that thing. Looks that is flipping awesome. I had them put the butter and sour on the side just because. Thank you. Sure. I appreciate that. That looks awesome. awesome. Everything awesome. looks okay? It's it so looks good. awesome. Thank you. You're very welcome. Enjoy. This is a happy woman. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I almost put it up to your face. Let me see how big is it. Bigger than my face. Rachel's beating me. Look at, that's all she's got left. I can always keep her butt eating. I can look, eat you under the table. Look at that. You've got that. I've got this much. And she's done. It's so stinking delicious. I still have more food left. I have that and I have that. Are you getting to that point where you have to decide what your last bite gonna be? Oh, my last bite? Yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking it's gonna be this piece of fat right here. But then again, the broccoli is really good. It's like cooked perfectly. Gotta end with the fat cap. No, I don't know. I kinda wish we were at home though so that we can like pour all the juice off of our plate into a cup and drink it. Or lick our plates. That truly was the proper human diet. <laughs> That was love. That was delicious. It was really, really good. Great waitress, great place. If you're looking for dining out options where you just know you're gonna find something mega delicious, super fresh, Texas Roadhouse. I cannot believe we just ate 20 ounce prime ribs. Peach. High five to that. Now we have to go home and film kid on the couch. Are we ready to tape? You know, these phones have the most amazing cameras. This is the iPhone 11 Pro Max. So amazing that we're actually selling one of our little portable cameras, our Sony ZV-1, because it's a great camera, but the battery lasts 30 minutes and I'm tired of like carrying around 10 batteries. And this honestly takes better photos. There is an issue with a phone as a camera though. What? You constantly have to be like cleaning off the lenses because your hand is always grabbing them and then like, it's you know, greasy. Like, everything is foggy and greasy because there's grease or dirt or grime all over the glass on the front and the back. Sometimes just in South Florida, because you're going in from air conditioning to hot and muggy, you can just have some condensation. Yeah. I mean, you get that on a regular camera too, but yeah, as Not much like as I phone. love the phone cameras, it's such a pain like to have to remember to clean the lens first. <laughs> We're going to film keto on the couch.
what happens to me when he hits a Rachel? Like, look at that. Like, I get so, like, oily. And I am growing a nice crop of grays. Look at that. Uh, so it's going to be a mighty fine harvest. So we just finished keto on the couch. But now that you're talking about the grays. So we went out to eat. It's delicious. Then we had to stop at the church on the way home because I had this gut feeling that, like, I need to stop and check the computers because we don't listen go in on Saturdays anymore. to your gut. When your gut says something, listen to that thing, which is... Speaking of. So I'm going through all the computers and I find somebody has removed the HDMI cable from one of the computers to the television. Why? Who who did that thing? Satan? So I'm like, I'm glad we stopped. But then we're on our way home and I don't know, we got the bright idea of let's watch videos on how to strip color out of your hair. Even though Rachel is going to somebody, a friend of hers who is a stylist who said, it's going to take time, but Just I can wait. do this. Just be patient. But you need to give me a month before I can get you in. Just be patient is like the worst three words you could say to me. <laughs> Just be patient. I can't do that. So we start watching videos on how to strip color out of your hair. And Rachel comes across a product called what? Color Oops? And, oh, Color Fix. There's Color Fix. And that's the one that, that this person in this YouTube video is saying. Because is YouTube like, is like, we're all really smart, right? You, like, you go on YouTube when you want to learn something, right? So this lady says that Color Fix is even better than Color Oops because it's sold at Sally Beauty Supply. And that way, only hairdressers are using it. And that's the one to use. And this girl was actually featured on that channel that you like to watch that probably should be the first heads up right <laughs> the first one. brad mondo right that's if, his name brad mondo. brad mondo has featured your do-it-yourself hair coloring yeah, why are we listening to then her maybe you're not an expert so we say you know what there's a sally's on the way home let's stop at sally and get this color fix and we go in and the girl goes, well, we're sold out of it, but let me ask you what you're trying to accomplish. I love that because you feel like you don't want to full disclose. I don't know why. She's there to help. Why do you not want to full disclose? Like, I'm like, I don't know. What what should I say that will get me the product that I want? Because she's right. like, what are you trying to do? And I'm she's like, like, I may have another product. She's like, I may have something else. Just tell me what you're interested in doing. And I was like, I'm trying to get down to my natural hair color without like totally bleaching the fool out of it. So... Um, yeah, can I do that with these like hair stripping things? And she's like, no, you're gonna turn your hair green. Stop it, don't, just, you're gonna have to wait. She's like, cut your hair and then let all of the gray grow out and it's gonna take you six months. That, and Rachel's like, I don't wanna do that. The beautiful, helpful, awesome Sally's lady said, just be patient. The three words I don't want to hear. So she was completely right and I, you know, thanked her very much. And then I said, where's the next Sally's? Is there another Sally's? So we get in the car, we're heading home and she's like, there is a Sally's right there. Can we stop and see if they have it? Because I don't know if that girl knows what she's talking and about. If the, and if the person that wants to help us asks us, let's give, let's be even more vague and give them less information so that I can get the product that I want and not have to wait. And do you know what? Those helpful people at Sally was like, what are you trying to do? <laughs> and then when I gave them my nonsense answer, they're like, what are you really trying to do? And like a lie detector test that I was failing miserably, I had to say like, I'm trying to strip out, I'm trying to go gray. And guess what they said? Just be patient. <laughs> they're like, it's not gonna work. We don't have any in stock, but it's gonna turn your house, your hair green. Or at best orange. The, yeah. Your best shot is Ronald McDonald land. Is that where you want to go? Is that who you want to be the mayor of? Ronald McDonald land? So no. we had all of that to come home to film Keto on the Couch. So guess what? Keto on the Couch was filled with a bunch of nonsense. Like five takes of my nonsense. That was just the opening was five takes. I just, I'm sorry. And then Rachel's I'm sorry, nonsense. sorry, Editing Joe. Yeah, thank you. Sorry, Editing Joe. He's I've got like weeding two hours stuff. of footage that hopefully I can get it down to 45 minutes. Just swimming through. Non You're going to need a snorkel. I am. And a pair of flippers. Because Rachel's Ahoy, silliness leads to my being silly. And then when you get me being silly, which is not very often. It's, but it's powerful. It's pretty powerful. It's, so. it's a potent nonsense. We had a good day. It was good. Rachel decorated the chicken coop. I, I don't know why. I ran to Gander. I got I you a bunch of shoes. <laughs> I know why. I had to return something. I got you shoes. 
and I got stuff to make sure that if we have a roof leak, I can fix it. That was very important. I'm very excited. What are you trying to put your shoes up? About my shoes. There was a time where you could not put your shoes up in front of your head. There was a time when I could not tie these shoes. Yeah. I could not tie my own shoes. So it was a productive day. We had an incredible dinner. That was really awesome. Yeah. We filmed Keto on the Couch. And now we're going to go to bed because we have to get up early. It was awesome. I don't know. That's not a word. That's going to be today's vlog. Now, if you like seeing videos like this, we have an entire playlist of full day of eating videos, which you're going to find right down there. Also, make sure you take a look at our most recent video, which you're gonna find right over here. Whether you head this way or you head this way, don't forget to head this way. Subscribe to our channel, click the little bell icon. That way you'll be notified every single time there's nonsense because it's in all directions. Until next time, bye. bye.